Hey everyone, it's Victor here again, and I'm here to talk to you about one of the most disappointing games I thought came out that entire year, Resistance. Um, so I start out this video by showing you off, by showing off the vertical, the horizontal, and the uh, circles, or at least I think I showed a circle. Did I? Oh yeah, there it is. Um, yeah, so Brink. <laughs> uh, does Brink calibrate well? I guess the best way to say this is that Brink calibrates to the point where it is completely playable and completely fun. Well, for as fun as Brink ever actually gets. You know, like, this just wasn't a very good game in general. Um, you could see me running around here. I'm, I'm in campaign. I'm not playing online. Um, I, I didn't want to sit in a lobby all day for, like, the five people who actually bought this game and played it. And still have it. So, you know, you can see me run around and play here. Um, all the running around and like climbing and sliding things are still there, and all those things still work. But it's just really not. It, it doesn't. It's just you know, it's not. A, it's not a very good game in the first place. Like you'll just see me mow through like tons and tons of people in a second. It, it, it's kind of ridiculous, especially on campaign and. Uh, you know, it, it calibrates to the point where it's serviceable. It because it's a because uh, it's a kind of weird game. Um, you know, with its controls, mapping on the keyboard was a little difficult. But you know, it's not too hard. Um, yeah, that's really all I have to say about this game. It calibrates pretty okay um, with just like slight modifications. Um, but in general, this just wasn't the the greatest game to have ever come out on any of these systems. But, you know, just uh, finish watching the gameplay, and I hope you all have a good day.